Good morning, YouTube. Tennessee Wingman here with you. We are in Ludowisi, Georgia. That's about 25 miles south of our house. It is St. Patrick's Day. Happy St. Patrick's Day to everybody. I hope you're wearing green, unless you'd like to get pinched. We are headed down to St. Simons Island to meet up with the going chapter from Hinesville, Savannah to have lunch. Turned into a beautiful day. Uh, it currently in this about 70 degrees. Started out at about 55 when we left the house. So we got about another 30 minute ride to get up to the meeting place. Hope we make it on time. Little Wissy is a very uh, simple, small town. There ain't a whole lot going on here. Of course, all the towns around here are kind of little small towns with nothing going on around here. Let's recap our trip for down to uh, Daytona Bike Week down to Ormond Beach. We left Friday morning in a very misty fog. And by the time we got to an hour from Jacksonville, we were in a flood. We got to the hotel and everything was, we were, we were drenched. We had a rain suit on and that kind of thing, I, but my boots had soaked through and so I made a point to get some waterproof boots while I was there. Cycle gear was right across the highway. And uh, we went to dinner with uh, Bob Nelson. He went to road down there with us. He followed us in his truck. We woke up uh, Saturday morning to uh, cold and blustery temperatures. By the time we got out and get going, we were in the low to mid 50s all day. The wind blowing. Not a pretty thing. So we went down to the Broken Spoke Saloon where I met Rusty Wallace. Pictures are on Facebook, go check that out. That was pretty neat. I was a big fan of Rusty's when he was uh, driving and first started out in NASCAR when cars were cars and you could tell what he was driving and he drove a Pontiac Grand Prix and you know you could tell a Ford Thunderbird and you could tell a Monte Carlo and you know just now that every car looks the same. But it was really nice to meet him. Saturday night we got lost coming back in Jacksonville. Uh, we were around in circles for an hour. Not really in circles, it just followed my GPS and it's kind of confused. So that was kind of funny. Bob Nelson thought that was a hoot. <laughs> Thank you, Bob, <laughs> for playing along. What a game. So Sunday morning we woke up and it was like 39 degrees. And we're like, eh, I don't know if we want to do this. So we made a command decision to sit right there, enjoy the warmth, go out and get something to eat, spend another night in a hotel. We came back Monday and it was mid 60s and real nice weather all the way back. Just like it is right now. So, that was our trip. It was pretty good, I suppose. Bike did great. The little trailer did great. 2012 Honda Goldwing can't beat it. It is the ultimate machine. I'll probably get a lot of <laughs> I'll get a lot of comments from that from all of my Harley riding buddies. Hey, it's two wheels. We're up on it. We're on it. We're all good. Anyway, we're uh, going to run down here and meet the Gold Wingers and have have, uh, have a lunch and see what they're up to if it may be riding this afternoon. I don't know. So, until we get back to you, Tennessee Wingman's out.